Hi, hi, hi. Um, so recently I purchased um, Cinema, which is a uh, movie app, and it's a company. I actually got this back in the end of May, I believe. Um, it took a while because they were overwhelmed with all the orders, but I finally got it. I activated it sometime in July, I think. I don't really remember. But anyway, I'm just going to go over my short summary of what it is and if it's worth it or not. Um, I ended up paying for a whole year. I think I paid about $6 a month. And what you get with that, or the plan I selected, is I get to see two standard uh, movies a month. Now, I don't have the physical card that they were supposed to send. I don't know if they're still sending it or not. I don't really know. But you're still able to use it without the card, the physical card. So how it works, you open the app up, you'll look at the movies, and you'll see a movie you want to see. It'll pull up the theaters nearby. Then what you're going to have to do is you're going to go onto the... Um, It'll show what um, movie tickets or sellers are selling them. So basically, short terms, what it means is it'll show different options. It might have um, adamtickets.com, etc. You'll go on there. You'll go to the, the movie you want to see, the time. Make sure there's a seat available. You'll go back into the app. You'll say, yeah, there's a seat available. You'll go forward. It'll give you a... Um, a one-time uh, credit card number and all the information. You go back into that website, you enter that in, and you're paid for. So, and then you're sent an email, and you have your ticket. Easy enough, right? Well, here's the problem with that. So, Cinema, they cover the ticket cost, but since I don't have a card physically yet, you're doing the advanced ticketing thing, therefore, you're gonna get charged whatever that website is charging. Sometimes that I've done it twice. The first time I did it, it was like a buck seventy-five extra per, for the ticket um, in advance. The other time it was a buck fifty. So let's say you went to two standard movies, and each time you paid a dollar fifty per um, advance ticket for those. So you're basically going to pay six bucks plus an extra three dollars in fees. So that comes out to be nine dollars a month for two movies is it worth it i don't think it is um but if you're only going to see that many movies in a month eh, you basically have to weigh the pros and cons with it i personally i don't think it's worth it i think there's a lot better movie options out there but again you have to look at it from what is best for you so just a little bit overview of it um, but anyway, have a good night. Bye.